Also new at 5 o'clock, a Fort Carson soldier is preparing to compete in the Olympics. Radio 13's Carlos Sosa joins us live from Fort Carson to explain what it means for this soldier to represent the U.S. in the Paris Olympics. Carla. Staff Sergeant Leonard Kiora says it's an honor to represent the country that welcomed him with open arms. He's been training hard for the Olympics for the past five months. The U.S. is proud of the winning medal, so thank you guys. Today, Staff Sergeant Leonard Correa met with children in this year's YMCA summer camp. He shared stories about growing up in Kenya and his Army career. Korea says it's been a long and tough journey to make it to the Olympics. It's exciting to make the Olympic team, especially to make the U.S. Olympic team. It's not easy. In February, he won the bronze medal in the U.S. Olympics. His time, 2 hours, 9 minutes and 57 seconds. And for the past five months, he's intensively trained. Now he's just ready to cross the finish line. I'm just trying to take it easy now, try to back down and get, the, get ready mentally for the event, which is coming so fast. This will be his second time representing the U.S. in a worldwide event, a lifelong goal. When I was younger, I used to look up to them and say, I want to be a runner too. So when I started running in high school, I got a chance to come to the U.S. to run in a college. I got a scholarship to run in NCAA. So I'm living the Olympic, uh, the, the, the American dream of representing the U.S. and also representing the Army. So I'm so happy, thankful. Staff Sergeant Leonard Correa will be flying out to Paris tomorrow. He'll be competing in the Olympics marathon event on August 10th. Reporting live in Fort Carson, Carlos Sosa, KRDO 13. All right, Carlos, thanks.